activate Fluffy Station. It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about Fluffy Wonders. Activate Fluffy Station. It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about Blippi. Mmm, what's better than a delicious piece of fruit? You're right, Debo. Vegetables are yummy too. Hmm, I wonder, what's the difference between fruits and vegetables? Super suggestion! We'll go into that garden to figure it out. I'm gonna need wings and a grabber arm. Wings, grabber arm, confirmed. Okie dokie, artichokey. Activate Blippy Station. Shrinking down! The Blippy Mobile is ready for adventure. All right, we're in a community garden where all kinds of fruits and vegetables grow. Look, there's one right now. Step right up. You're the next contestants on Slim Cucumber Certified Fresh Game Show. Fruit or vegetables? Say hello to your names. Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. <laughs> Blippi and Debo, a quick review before we start. All fruits have a pit or seeds in them and grow on a plant with flowers. Fruits have pits or seeds and always flowers. Got it. And vegetables are different. There are root and leaves. Got that too. Excellent. Let's play. Tell me, Blippi, is this carrot a fruit? Oh. Ooh, the carrot is a vegetable because it's a root and has leaves. That's right! But can Blippi go two for two? So tell me, is this tomato a fruit or a vegetable? Hmm, this is tough. Okay, a tomato grows from a plant, but it has seeds. It's also a vegetable? Oh, sorry. Tomato is a fruit. Now, your final question, Blippi. Can you tell me if this strawberry is a fruit or vegetable? Strawberry is a, a fruit. Yes, strawberry is a fruit. And you get two correct answers, which means this trophy is all yours. Wow. Thanks, Mr. Slim. And I also have the answer to my question. What's the difference between fruits and vegetables? Vegetables are roots and leaves, and fruits have flowers in a pit or seeds. Upload answer, Debo. Bye-bye, Mr. Slim. Congrats to you, Blippi. That's our game. I'm Slim the Cucumber, and by the way, I'm a fruit. Tune in next time for our special guest, Madame Mango, on Fruit of Vegetables. Don't worry, Debo. Those aren't real monsters. They're trick-or-treaters, because it's Halloween. Of course, Debo. I can teach you how to trick-or-treat. Did somebody say trick-or-treat? Whoa. Oh, hi, Rita. This is my friend, Debo. Hi, Debo. I'm Rita the raccoon, and Halloween is my favorite holiday. Because of all the costumes? No, silly. All the free food! Ha! <laughs> well, you're just in time because Debo and I are about to go trick-or-treating. Wait, Debo! We still need a few things before we go. The first thing we'll need are costumes. Great idea! We'll be ghosts! <laughs> so fun! Even ghosts need to be able to see. There we go. Ooh, ooh. Boo. <laughs> I'm a blippy ghost. Whoa. <laughs> We've got a karate master trick-or-treating with us. Opa. And now a chef. <laughs> so cool. Boo. <laughs> With a mask. Our costumes are ready. Time for the next step. 
containers to hold our treats. Cool jack-o'-lantern pails. My first treat! Now it's time to hit the streets! It's getting dark! A glowing ghost! Fun! Okay! <laughs> Be sure to pick a house that is decorated and lit up for Halloween. Then knock on the door and say, Trick or treat! Come on! What are you waiting for? <laughs> Trick or treat! Thank you! Happy Halloween! What? Shoot! Remember, you can only go to each house one time and just take one piece of candy. Trick or treat! Ha <laughs> ha! Jackpot! That'll last you till next Halloween! Those scare me every time! <laughs> Trick or treat! Trick or treat! Look, look what, what I, I got. got! Whoa! Look at all these treats! Thanks for helping me teach Debo how to trick or treat, Rita! And remember, Debo, to trick or treat, you need a costume and a bag or pail for treats. Then, walk door to door, stop at the lit and decorated houses, say, trick or treat, to get goodies in return. And remember, you always need an adult. <laughs> yeah. Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Thanks for a sweet night, Rita. <laughs> Bye, Blippi and Debo. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. <laughs>
just need one more thing to keep me warm. What is it? I need an extra layer to keep warm in my cave. Pine needles! The bear version of a big, comfy blanket. Oh, thanks! That looks extra cozy. <sighs> I'm all ready for hibernation. And I couldn't have done it all in one day without your help. I think we made it just in time. Thanks for answering my question, Bella. Bears prepare for hibernation by eating a lot of healthy food and warming their dens in order to stay comfy in the winter months. <laughs> Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Have a great sleep, Bella. Bye, Blippi. Oh, take care of my hula hoop till summer, Debo. Ta-da! That egg looks egg-tastic, Blippi. <laughs> Thanks, Mika. What should I paint on my next one? Wow! Hi! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Catch that egg! <laughs> Hello, world! Whoa! Hey! It's me, Blippi, and this is Mika and Debo. Oh. Hi there, Blippi! I'm Beanie the Jelly Bean! A super surprise is waiting for you when you find all the eggs. Are you ready for your first clue? It's a scavenger hunt! Hmm, I wonder, can we find all the eggs that lead to the super surprise? <laughs> Here's your first clue. Ahem. When you want to bust out a silly dance, try this spot to spin and prance. Silly dance, spin and prance. Oh, I think I know just the spot. The theater. Hmm, but where's the next clue? <laughs> I think he wants us to join in. loose board. Our second clue. Hi, I'm Cheep Cheep. I've got your next clue. <laughs> You've solved one clue for your Easter party, but you'll get even closer if you follow Do Re Mi Mi Mi. It's a musical clue. To the musical bridge. <laughs> Stop! Oh, stop! <laughs> Try copying me. La, 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 la. Let's play along with Chi Chi. La, 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 la. It's working! Our third clue! Oh, no! We'll save you, little egg. Oh, here it is. Howdy! I'm Rocket, the fastest chocolate rabbit in these parts. Staying right here would be unwise. You gotta chase me to find your super surprise. <laughs> the chocolate chase is on! Whoa! Look at Rocket go! You've almost got him, Debo! It's the super surprise! We did it! Debo, look out! Whoa! Wow! Now that's a super surprise! <laughs> Thanks, Beanie, Cheep Cheep, and Rocket for answering my question. We found our super surprise. The treat baskets! Upload answer, Debo. But I wonder, who hid all the eggs? Activate Blippi Station! It's time, get up and shout! I wonder what we'll learn about Blippi Wonders! Mwah. Nice catch, Debo! Do you hear that? That's one cool beat. I can't stop moving. <laughs> hmm, I wonder, why does music make us want to dance? 
Hi, Blippi. Hi, Mika. Hey, Benjamin. That was some pretty sweet beatboxing you were doing. Yeah! It made me want to dance! Hey, Benjamin. Do you know why music makes us want to move our bodies and dance? I sure do. Just shrink down to my size and I'll show you. All right. Shrinking down! Awesome! Now we're ready to party. Yeah! Hit it, DJ D-Bops! When we hear music, we enjoy the sound of it. This beat makes me want to move my feet. I love this song. And our bodies want to explain how the noise is being made. So we move in a way that matches the rhythm. On the beat. Woo, a classical song. Love your moves, Blippi. Check out yours, Mika. <laughs> now we've got the same moves. Together. Woohoo! Hey, DJ D Bops, pick up that tempo! Flippy, I challenge you to a dance off! It's on! Dance on! Go, Flippy! Go, Flippy! Break it down, Mika! a nice ring. It makes me want to sing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I almost forgot one more thing about dancing. What is it? That it's super fun. Oh, yeah. It's a blast. <laughs> Thanks for answering my question, Benjamin. Music makes us want to dance because our bodies want to match the beat it's a great way to connect with friends, and it's so much fun! Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Who's ready for a dance-off? Round two. <laughs> it's on! Dance on! <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> Debate Blippi Station. It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about Flippy Wonders. Woohoo! I'm in the lead. Ah, <gasps> baby chick straight ahead. Change course. Silly somersault. Hey, it's me, Blippy, and this is Mika and Tabs. Penelope, can you help me? I think I'm lost. Good question, Tabs. I wonder, how can we help Penelope find her way home? What's the last thing you remember, Penelope? All I remember is following a rainbow leaf. And now I'm here. Great thinking, Tabs. We should shrink down to Penelope's size so we can see things like she does. Shrinking down! Look! Penelope's footprints! Let's retrace her steps. <laughs> I found you, Rainbow Leaf! Hey, Penelope! Wait for us! <laughs> it's so squishy! <laughs> Penelope, that's a butterfly. <laughs> a butterfly? Oh. Penelope, does any of this look familiar to you? Um, no. But I do remember a forest of yellow suns. Blippi, look! The 
That's it! Oh, you mean yellow sunflowers, Penelope? Penelope? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's so pretty up here. We made it! Mini celebration dance! Can you see your house from here, Penelope? No, but I remember something. A field of black and white clouds. I hear cows mooing over there. Oh, Penelope, those aren't black and white clouds. They're cows. <laughs> oh. That looks like fun. <laughs> Oh, oh. Come on! The cows are this way. That was fun. Hey, Tabs! Tag! You're it! Oh, no. Not again. <laughs> oh, wow! Woohoo! Whoa! You can't catch me! Woohoo! Whoa! And I got the answer to my question. How can we help Penelope find her way home? We helped Penelope find her way home by using our eyes and ears to observe the environment around us. Upload answer tabs. Ooh, a fuzzy, fuzzy, wuzzy. <laughs> Bye, Penelope. Whoops! <laughs> Excuse me! That was a big burp, Flippy! Hmm, I wonder, why do people burp? Oh, I can tell you, but it's more fun to show you! Off to the nearest mouth! All right, I'm gonna need frog legs! Frog legs confirmed. Shrinking down! The Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure! Open wide! Whee! <laughs> this is perfect! He's chewing way too fast! Look at all the air he's swallowing! Whoa! Well, that was fun! Debo, you can open your eyes now. I think it's over. Here we go again! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! I'm gonna need monkey arms! Monkey arms confirmed. Whoa! 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 What's that? It's called the esophagus. We all have them! It's a long tube that connects the throat to the stomach. Woo! Esophagus! That's a fun word. E-so-f-a-gus! <coughs> Whoa! He's coughing up a storm! <laughs> oh yeah! These are ideal conditions for a big old burp! Boobs away! Oh no! Hang on to your seats, everybody! Whoa! So cool! Careful! The bubble's delicate and can explode at any moment! <laughs> yes! Get it! Get it, Ball! Whee! <laughs> oh, yeah! The bubble is all the extra air that this guy swallowed! It's like a trampoline! Whoa! whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> uh oh! Too much bouncing! It's gonna blow! Whoa! The air bubble is rising up the esophagus and toward the mouth. <laughs> Whoa. Excuse me. Oh, yeah. Experiment complete. <laughs> that was so fun. And I got the answer to my question. Why do people burp? People burp when they swallow too much air and it builds up inside the esophagus. 
the body gets rid of the air by burping. <coughs> Upload answer, Debo. I think it's time to dance! Boom, cha-cha, boom, cha-cha, boom! Let's boom, cha-cha with boom! Boom, cha-cha, boom, cha-cha, boom! All right, let's have a picnic. There are a bunch of ants, Tabs, and they're all walking together. Hmm, I wonder, why do ants walk in a line? Good idea, Tabs. We can shrink down to ant size and find out. I'm gonna need spider legs. Spider legs, confirmed. Activate Flippy Station. Shrinking down! The Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure! Ah, y'all, welcome. I'm Anita, and this is my group of amazing ants. Hey, it's me, Blippy, and this is Tabs. Anita, we're here to find out why ants walk in a line. Well, jump on in our line and find out. We're going to get snacks for a big old potluck back home. Thanks, Anita. Sounds yummy. You betcha. Well, hi, Maribel. Oh, my, that snack you have looks delish. So, where'd you find the food? A heap of thanks for the info, Maribel. We ants exchange information through our antennas. Let's go, y'all! Uh-oh! Nice birdie! <laughs> Whoa! Hello? Hello? Anita? Hello! We're here! Right back on the trail, sweet pea. There's a trail? I don't see it. You can't see it? because it's a smell. When we walk, we drop a scent, and the ants behind us smell it using their antennas. So ants have antennas instead of noses? <gasps> Look, your antennas are twitching. That's right, my antennas are a-twitching because they sense something tasty in this direction. Careful, y'all, bumpy road ahead. <laughs> Anita led us right back to our picnic blanket. My word. Okay, ants, let's get some food. Remember, teamwork makes the dream work. Whoa! <laughs> Grapes are good. Walnuts are yum. Cheese and crackers. I'm tickled pink. I can't believe that ants can lift all that. Yes, sir. We ants can carry more than 10 times our own body weight. Okay, y'all, let's hop on that trail and follow the scent back home. Just like follow the leader. Now I have the answer to my question. Why do ants walk in a line? Ants walk in a line because the ant in front drops a trail of smells behind her and the other ants follow it. <laughs> Upload answer tabs. Bye, Anita. Great to be in a line with y'all. Bye-bye, <laughs> Blippi. What's making that sound? Oh, it's a race car. It's going so fast. Huh? You're right, the Blippi Mobile could never go that fast. Hmm, I wonder, why are race cars so much faster than regular cars? Good idea, Debo. We can go to the racetrack and find out. I'm gonna need race car tires. Race car tires confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Hi! Are you here to try out the racetrack? Hey, 
Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Devo. We're actually here to find out why race cars are so much faster than regular cars. Hi, I'm Ricardo. Let me show you on the track. Let's race. All right. Before we race, I have a really important job for you, Devo. I need you to be the captain of the pit stop. During the race, I'll pull in here so you can keep me in tip-top shape. Can you help out and do that job? <laughs> oh, nice try, Debo. But what you'll be doing is gassing up my tank and swapping out my tires. Okay, race time! Helmets on and buckle up! I'm going really fast. Whoa! I'm not even going as fast as I can. Only 180 miles per hour now. Race cars are made out of a lighter material than regular cars. Plus, my shape helps me race easier into the wind. It's called aerodynamics. You and my Blippi Mobile are definitely different shapes. Pit stop, Captain. Do you can do it, Debo! Ricardo, do you have special tires? I do! My tires are wider and softer than regular car tires, so I can go even faster on this super hot track! Thanks, Debo! Now you're even faster! My powerful engine is five times stronger than a regular car's. I can reach my top speed of 220 miles per hour. See you at the finish line, Blippi! Whoa! I'm blown away! But now I have the answer to my question. Why are race cars so much faster than regular cars? It's because race cars are aerodynamic and made out of a lighter material, have special tires to race on the hot track, and a super powerful race car engine! Huh? Upload answer, Debo. Bye-bye, <laughs> Ricardo! Bye, Blippi! Bye, Debo! Ciao!